Alright guys, we're back here at CES checking out an all new robot. This here is Adam. And I actually have Timothy here with me yes. uh, on behalf of Rich Tech Robotics. Yes. Can you tell us a little bit more about your robot? Yeah, so this is Adam. So Adam's the first commercially deployed AI-driven humanoid robot in the U.S. That means we've deployed him in New York, Oakland, California, and Las Vegas, Nevada as a barista and also as a bartender as well. He can make over 100 different types of drinks. Now, uh, can you use them for other applications as well? Or Yeah, most definitely. So besides making drinks, Adam can also talk to you. Um, and then Adam Arms can actually also operate like a frying basket to make like french fries or chicken tenders, uh, stuff like that. Can we take a closer look? Yeah, most definitely. Let's go inside. All right. All right, come on. Let's take a look. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah. Very cool. So this is Adam right here. Um, so Adam's doing his thing, serving up coffee. Um, Adam communicates through an API with this coffee machine right here. Okay. Um, this coffee machine can serve pretty much any kind of coffee, latte, espresso, whatever you can think of. Um, we also have an ice machine over there that Adam works with. Um, and then just a couple components on the table itself. You can see Adam's about to pour. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nice, beautiful froth out of the milk frother that he uses. Um, and then he also has treacles in front of him that sort of feed ingredients sure such as like syrups and other things to add flavor. Nice. The last thing is he puts it on the white pedestals um, and that just makes it so that uh, people can see their name in the front oh, so they know that pretty cool. their drink is ready. And then like uh, how many degrees of freedom does this robot have? Yeah, so he has six different joints and each of these joints have varying degrees of freedom uh, ranging all the way up to 270 degrees. Oh wow. And then the maximum amount of weight that this robot can carry technically? Maximum amount of weight for each arm is going to be 11 pounds. Oh wow, very nice. Uh, and roughly, how much do you say a robot like this would retail for, just for the public? Yeah, so we uh, do a revenue share program or we do a leasing program. For the leasing program, it's going to be about $3,500 a month for Adam and all the system components. Are you doing a dance? Yeah. Oh, we got to record He's that. He's keeping the people entertained. <laughs> I love that. Oh, so cool. All right, now I got to get a drink. Let's yeah, do this. Yeah, let's do all it. Right, come on. Such a cool experience though. <laughs> ah, thank you, yeah. My personal favorite is a foamy hazelnut latte. Let's do it, All let's right, do it. Cool. So once we send it in through the tablet, it gets put in the queue, no? and then Adam will serve it okay. after the other drinks. Okay. And then we're just having um, Alex here put the drinks on our Maitre D'L robot. Oh, so you got this is one of our server. yeah. This is our most popular robot. We've deployed like 200 of them in the last two years. So we have a couple of different delivery robots. This one's made for restaurants, but we also have ones made for hotels okay. and hospitals oh, nice. that can uh, travel up and down elevators and have multiple compartments. And then we also do cleaning robots. This is one of them, Dusty SX. It's okay. basically a floor cleaning robot that can sweep, mop, and scrub. So does uh, Adam accept tips? Uh, that's a great question. This one we always get. Um, it's up to you if you want to tip him or not, but he can talk. Oh, yeah. So just know if you don't tip him, he might say something smart. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> now, how many cameras does this robot have? And Yeah, so you can see in the center. I um, see that, yeah. That's the new upgrade that we're unveiling this year. So that's an NVIDIA camera. Okay. What we're doing with that is we're giving Adam the ability of sight. Um, so that he can see when people step up to him, so he knows to interact with them. And so he can also see his workspace and respond to changes in the workspace. This is just his coffee systems. Right now he's doing hot and cold coffee. Um, but he also is a bartender. So the Kardashians rented him out as a bartender for one of their parties. Yeah, he was serving salted rim margaritas there. Um, and then we also have a boba tea program. Oh wow, um, really? That's in the Las Vegas location. That's so, so cool. It's pretty fast too, surprisingly. Yeah, so it's 50 to 60 seconds. So if you ask a human barista to make a coffee as fast as possible, mm -hmm. they can most likely beat Adam, right? Yeah. But in the real world, humans are talking to their coworkers, they're looking on their phone, That's true. distracted by all sorts of things going on. So in the real world, Adam can definitely keep pace with any human barista. <laughs> As for you. All right. Thank you, Adam. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> nice. Thank you, thank you. All right, well, with that said, if you guys had any questions, comment down below. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Okay. Bye. I am going to have to take your word for it, Colin. But he said that was the best coffee he has had in a while.